leadership is the key to the development of any organization, be it secular, spiritual, family, in any sphere of life. This is according to the chaplain of the Anglican Youth Fellowship, Abuja Daosisian Council, the Venerable Ovie Zumerue, while speaking at the leadership training program. Zubechi Frank reports that the training was organized for the newly elected Daosisian Council officials of Abuja Daosis. Now the report. Having understood that training is key and when preparedness meets opportunity, success is inevitable. The Anglican Youth Fellowship Abuja Daosis Council organized a one-day leadership training program to help build and inculcate capacity into the incoming executives, nuggets of quality leadership attributes that will make them outstanding in their leadership tenure. Leadership is key to the development of any organization be it secular, spiritual, family, in any sphere of life. If the leadership goes wrong, everything goes wrong. And that is why we are doing this program, trying to build leadership capacity so that our fellowship, the AYF, can be stronger, more productive, and can make more impacts. The training featured talks and principles of biblical leadership, the perfect man model, Group discussion where each group had to do a SWOT analysis on AYF and come up with a strategic plan. Talk on maximizing social media as a tool for effective youth ministry, amongst others. Speaking in an interview, one of their resource persons, the Director of Communications Church of Nigeria Anglican Communion, Venerable Asan John, the outgoing president and the incoming president, spoke on the essence of the program and what to expect. Our youth need to consistently be encouraged and then equipped. Now, equipping comes in new skills, new knowledge, meeting all the time, rubbing minds, understanding where the world is going, what our ambitions and our responsibilities are, and indeed also what our dreams are. We, we are trying to um, promote um, leadership that is modeled um, in Christ Jesus. And also, in, in terms of the fellowship itself, we found out that um, the people will need to understand what it means to um, lead uh, in the Anglican Youth Fellowship the responsibilities and how to be able to sustain the vision. I must say first of all it's been quite insightful, mind-blowing and innovative and it's a way to go and I, I think we should be having more of this going forward. We should be having more of this at least to reassure ourselves, come back, weigh ourselves, re-examine ourselves, what are the areas we have not done well, what are the areas we need to improve. Because leadership, no one knows it all. Meanwhile, in his capacity as the chaplain of the Anglican Youth Fellowship, Abuja Daosisian Council, used the opportunity to advise both the outgoing and incoming executives. So the outgoing as goes is that they should remain focused and do the right things that they have learned over the years. They should not go and be docile in the pews. They should go back into the main congregation do their best, support these fresh leaders and those around them as youths and keep doing the good work. The incoming one, one thing that I've told them which I know is very key, a call to leadership is a call to confront challenges. Most people feel leadership is jamboree. It's not jamboree. You are there to solve problems.